hello this is monica from informatica in this video we will see how to add rules in a population file the agenda for this meeting a video is first we will see what is the population rules and then we will see how to add or edit the population rules Basically, what is meant by population and where it will be used in the MDM. In match and match merge strategy, we use the fuzzy, fuzzy. In that fuzzy match strategy, we need that population files. So, sorry, population file encapsulates intelligence about name, addresses, and other identifications. So. what how this population file helps so it helps like a common family names in each population gave the data and query performance also each population has a large number of uncommon names that tend to have the most error and variability so match needs to account for both of these situations to give the optimal performance for both in that case sometimes we need to add extra rules in the population files or we need to edit the existing rules so in this video we will see through mdm how we can edit or add new population rules so what the population file contains this file contains built in rules for identifying matches within a particular population and languages also it contains rules for how to build keys and perform searches for the type of data found in the selected population so it provides a predefined set of match columns and match purpose now we will see how to add population how to add rules in a population file first we need to mdm installation folder then hub hub from hub we, we have to go to resource kit folder in resource kit folder we will get a folder named as ssn m3 in ssn m3 there will be five folders in that pr folder we have to copy our population file in the default folder it will contain default population files if we want to edit our existing population file we need to copy that file into this pr folder you need to start the server for starting the server we have to run this file m3up.bat it will start the server after that we need to run this pop that file once we start the server we need to run this pop pom that dot bat file it will ask for it will show some it will show an warning after that we need to continue okay so this will open a new window where we can uh, this will be population override manager window here we can override existing rules we need to go to inter population override manager give the host name and port number and click on the connect button so here it will show what are the different population files we are having from that we need to select one and we have to select the corresponding population in which we need to add the files in this we will add rule in a usa population file click on okay it will ask for field override or purpose override okay so here we have launched the population to connect ssn m3 server we have to give host name and port number and click on the connect once we will connect to the host it will ask for the system and the population here we have selected system as a default and population as a usa population once we click on once we done successful connection it will ask for the override selection there are two option one is a field override and the second one is a purpose overrides okay um 
if if field override was selected it will ask for the which field we need to make changes so here we need to select a particular field here suppose i am now here i am selecting for the address for part 1 field okay then it will ask three option override frequency table override scalar frequency table and override edit rules here we will get three options override frequency table override scalar frequency table and override edit rules we have selected override edit rules and click on ok ok it will show usa population with override rules here we need to search rules for which we need to override the rule here we will add one rule for a phrase replacement rule for la place to la place so we need to click on add rules and we need to do since we want to phrase a replacement rule we have to select a phrase rule it will ask for which phrase and what replacement we need to do so we will add phrase as a so whenever we will get a phrase as a laplace it will replace with laplace ok so here we can add whatever the override comments and we have to click on ok so you will get the uh, override rule here you can select the overrides or you can discard the changes for now we will save that override By clicking on test button you can check whether the rule is added successfully or not. It will show test completed successfully. So we can save these changes by using commit changes. Ok changes committed successfully. In this way we can add new rules or we can override the existing rules in the SSN M3. Please note that we recommend that be before doing any changes in the population file, please contact to the Informatica support team. You can give your feedbacks fr uh, from support video at the rate informatica.com. Also, you can use Twitter to know about us. Thank you.